three biggest blocks of holding me back right now are not being worthy, uh, not feeling good enough, um, fear of rejection. Since Creatrix, I was able to execute that retreat, not only just with getting by, but we killed it. We, everyone that attended that retreat uh, left there just in awe and I just killed it. I, like it was just so easy and effortless and you know, we all just performed really, really well. It was fun. So I didn't have that nervousness. I didn't have that, that sort of little voice in my head going, oh, you're going to stuff it up or what, what happened? It just flowed. I just had flow and it just went really well and I'm so excited to start organising the next one. The sky's the limit. We've, we're already planning um, the next retreat. I've got my next workshop coming up in May. Um, and, and I'm just looking forward to, to the endless possibilities. It's interesting looking back at it now because it's just taken now a different level. Nine months down the track, uh, it's just been a whirlwind. Um, definitely has changed my life considerably. And, and, and to think that if I would have been told back then, in nine months' time, you're going to be doing this, this and this. I just would have said, holy shit. <laughs> it would have just been, uh, you know, no way. So not feeling good enough was another issue I had. And to have lived so much of my life with that, it really stopped me from doing a lot. So, um, conquering that through just this one simple process has been life changing because now not only have I managed to um, you know run workshops, I've run retreats, I've you know I'm changing jobs, I've um, you know building my business, I've changed my relationship, um, I've even changed my relationship with my kids and that's probably the most important that has come out of, you know, even if the other stuff hadn't eventuated, um, you know, just the relationship with my kids is massive.